This is the construction of the Brooklyn Bridge in 1881. This is Grand Central Station in 1900. Here is the construction of Fenway Park in Boston in 1914. Here's Boston in the year 1900. And here's Detroit in 1888. And all of this amazing infrastructure was built before there was a federal income tax, which didn't exist the first 137 years America was a country. So how did the government raise money before 1913? Tariffs. We taxed goods that came in from other countries. So if China wanted to sell to American markets, they had to pay for American roads. But in 1913, a small group of powerful bankers sold Americans on the Federal Reserve Bank and the 16th Amendment. Now they didn't need tariffs because they could tax you. So they started selling Americans on free trade, which is extremely profitable for international banks and corporations. And they told us that the costs of goods and services will go down. They left out that the Fed's endless printing of money would destroy the value of your dollar and that free trade would destroy American manufacturing and cost you your jobs. And this is why I write books on the corruption of the money system, the food system, how information is controlled, the trap of free, and so much more. Because if we want to give the next generation a fighting chance, we have to teach them the truth. ClassicalLearner.com